And it was a night of violence in the city of Boston. Police are investigating three separate shootings, and tonight, another young man is dead. WBZ's Beth Germano reports on the overnight crimes. Right through the window here and then hit the wall. A bullet that pierced the window in Dwayne Hines' bedroom. Another through a living room as shots rang out on Astoria Street in Mattapan late Saturday night. I was like in the house and I heard the shots. Roughly probably five, six, something like that. A male in his 30s found dead on the sidewalk in front of this home where a soccer party was underway. Around the corner, another victim injured by bullets as neighbors say he fled the scene. These are young folks. And whatever rivalry, whatever it's going on with them, I mean, it shouldn't have been. But it did happen. Shots fired in two more locations in Dorchester, injuring two more victims. Residents say there were several parties and worry about the outbreak of violence as the summer months approach. I guess somebody stepped on somebody's toes or look at somebody wrong and, oh, I'm coming back and whatever. And pop, pop, pop. One, two, three. Yeah! It all happened just hours before a Father's Day March for Unity. Boston Police Commissioner Bill Evans among those asking for help again in solving these crimes. As long as we do not come forward, then uh, people are going to think it's all right to, to take someone's lives and shoot because no one's going to come forward. And at the scene of the fatal shooting, there's fear and frustration. Residents say the violence and burst of gunfire was brought here to the street last night and had nothing to do with the party, something they call an all-too-familiar scenario. It's hard on everybody, the neighbor, plus the police officers. Trying to create peace in the streets. In Mattapan, Beth Germano, WBZ News.